Block Making Dev Day. I have a Master Block 410, six pins, full security pins, so the good old lockout tag out lock. Surprisingly, I haven't done one of these on video yet, so um, let's see if we get this sucker open up quick. My experience, these have pretty good feedback, so hopefully this will be quick. Quicker. Alright, I'm back home and I already did go ahead and start the process of gutting this. So I took my saw and went all along the sides here just to kind of get it pre-opened. And uh, I figured we'd just kind of break into it together. So it's mostly open here. Here we go. Oh, that's kind of perfect. Look, how, oh, that's perfect. So here is what it looks like. 
on the inside. You can see all the pins down there at the bottom. That's what's rattling. That is what our rattle is. And so when we pull it out, we pull out our, our core here. This is why it rattles. So when we turn our core completely upside down like this, all the, dirt, all the key pins fall through the bottom holes right here and which give us our rattle on the inside right here. So we'll go ahead and continue taking this apart. So let's move all this to the side, the actuator, the ball bearings, all that. We'll go ahead and pour out our key pins and we will turn this a little bit, but we'll have to also get our C-clip off and make sure that our driver pins don't fall into the key pin holes because if they do that then our springs will be stuck and it's semi-bricked and it's going to be a little pain in the butt to get because all of our springs will be in the way. So next step, we'll have to gut it without dropping any of the driver pins again inside of a hole. There we go, that worked perfectly. And so we do have one key pin left in here. <laughs> pin 5 right there fell out. And for our top pins then, our driver pins, we have a spool, 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 serrated very lightly, and a spool. There we go. And our our key pins, I'll figure those out as soon as I cut the video when I put it back together. But here is what is inside our Master 410. So yeah, all spools, one lightly serrated, and all of our key pins not serrated. So there we are. There's our Master 410. And there's our body. This is what the body looks like on the inside. And we already saw what it looked like when it was... Uh, pulled apart. It came apart like perfectly in half. That was very nice. Glad that happened. And uh, for one last showing, here's our bidding. And as you saw, there are no springs in these. These are dead cores. These are really fun to pick. Um, definitely pick some up. They're not too expensive. Before I go, I wanted to show this uh, little 3D printed model I have. It's actually missing a piece right here. But you can find a whole bunch of uh, bodies for these 410 padlocks online and just print one off if you decide to break one apart yourself. And you can actually see how it works here. So you can see in the back right here, you can see the actuator. You can see the holes right there for our um, ball bearings on both sides right there. So you can see a ball bearing right there speaking out. So turn that. And that'll line up the holes with the ball bearings on the side. That way when our polar shackle, the ball bearings would go in there. There we go. You can see them right there. You can see that one right there on that side. And then to close it, put it back. And this is a uh, dead core, so you have to um, shut it and close it yourself. And turn it back. There we go. So yeah, you can actually see the actuator moving in here, which is really cool. But you can find a whole bunch of these models online. So if I could take that out right there, you can see the actuator right there. So yeah, these are really cool, super helpful. And that way you can actually see how it works. And if you make this a cutaway, you can actually probably model yourself a little hole in the back of one of these to uh, so you can have a full cutaway of it. And before I go, I want to say hi to Gertog and Seven. It was good seeing you this year at DEF CON. Hope to see you again next year. Uh, man, this stuff was crazy. That was a whole lot of fun. Great seeing you. All right, everyone. I hope you enjoyed the uh, the the lock and the location this year. Um, this was my first rattle on camera. Thanks for watching.